All right, I thought I would do a video of Santa Rosa, uh, the neighborhood here. So here it is. Some of these houses are actually quite nice. Like that one down there. Uh, there's your typical wood one. But uh, yeah, this is Santa Rosa, Ancon, Peru. It's in the outskirts of uh, Lima. So it would kind of be like, if I can compare it to Vancouver, it would be like um, living in Vancouver and going out to Chilliwack. That's Richard. Hi, Sean. Hola. Melina's brother-in-law. He's uh, doing some work in uh, Melina's parents' house. So that's Melina's parents' house there. It's really nice. We got trees and things are growing. And Richard pretty much built most of this house. He's a builder. He builds houses in the area. He's also been building this one. Oh, and then some of these places are just abandoned. As you can see. I don't know if this one's abandoned or they're working on it. I think they're just working on it. Then you have some nice flowers growing here, bushes and trees. Yeah. And this is the little corner store that we always go and get our groceries. Well, here's a cactus with flowers growing out of it. Kind of cool. Ooh. Okay, puppy. And a lot of dogs. Lots of dogs in the neighborhood. <laughs> okay, buddy. Some of these dogs are territorial. It's another house there. Hola. Buenos dias. Yeah, so here is Santa Rosa. And these are the uh, mountains. They're they're pretty hard. It's not like sand. There is sand on it, but they are hard. It's not like soft like the sand here. pretty hard because I've climbed it. I've climbed to the very top before and overlooked the whole ocean and the whole town here. But anyways, here you have it. This is just one block of Santa Rosa. Oh, it's hot. It is 10 a.m. and it's already 24 degrees out. Wow, look at those houses up there. Oh, the other news uh, is last night around 10.30 at night, roughly, I don't know, 10, 10.30. We had a, a little earthquake. It was a 4.7, I believe. So I was sitting there Skyping with my friend, Ray, and we were getting into a little Bible study, and all of a sudden, the whole ground started shaking, and the house started shaking, and, uh, and then I ran right away just to make sure that I'd be ready to pull 
my daughter and my wife out just in case it would get more intense because that's what usually happens here sometimes is there will be a tremor and then hola buenos dias there will be a tremor and then uh uh, earthquake after follows the tremor and I've been here before where that's happened actually a few times so it's kind of neat but also alarming especially now that I have a five-month-old baby she's my main concern so yeah anyways so that was the news for last night so here we are Back into Melina's parents' house. And I'm going to get my Revelation chapter 15 video up. Ciao.